Hi guys, how you doing? This week I thought I would show you how to make these lovely, lovely, easy paintings. This one's pretty straightforward. These can look really professional and they're really effective. And they're really, really cool paintings. So if you want to see how to make these, stick around because here is what you're going to need. You are going to need some art canvases, some card, some scissors, some paint brushes, a pencil, a ruler, some watercolours, any you like, I'm using tinned, and some white spray paint. You may also need some Mud Podge, some white acrylic paint, some blue tack, and some coffee, although that's probably just me. Okay, so take your card and make sure it's the same size as your canvas is. And if it isn't, draw a line and cut it out. Then with your ruler, draw a border around this piece of card, just so you get a preference of where the animal should go for the painting. I'm freehanding my drawings, but if you're not comfortable doing that, you can always print off the animal silhouettes off the internet and just use them. Okay, so with your drawings, you're going to want to cut them out so you do have the animal silhouette. Then grab your canvas and place the silhouette in the centre or wherever you want them to lay. And then I did a light pencil outline of this, just so I knew where to focus the paint. Now do not throw these silhouettes away as you will be using them again, but for now, just go wild with your watercolours. You can do any colours you like, any style you like. I'm still getting used to watercolours because it's been a hot minute since I used them. So this may look really messy and really bad, but it does work out, I promise you. Okay, so if your card is quite fine like the one I used, I blue tacked my silhouettes down on top of the pencil outline. So I laid these rocks on top just so the silhouette wouldn't lift when I sprayed the spray paint. So yeah, just spray away. It took me about two layers on each painting, possibly three on the red one, just because the red was quite hard to cover up. Please do this outside or in a well ventilated area just because it can be quite overpowering. Okay, so I let mine dry for about three hours and then I slowly took the silhouette off and revealed the colours of the animals and these turned out quite cool and I was actually really pleased with them. So as you can see there is a small mark here, I presume it was my pencil, so this is where the white acrylic comes in. Because I used gloss spray paint there was quite a shine to them so I did use my matte Mod Podge just to give them a final coat once they are all properly dried just so there wasn't too much of a shine or a glare when the light hit them. Here they are, these are the three finished pieces I did. I really like these, I think they look really cool. I'm quite pleased with them. The deer one was a little bit patchy because of how fine lined the antlers were. So take that on board when choosing your selected animals. Well, I hope you liked this video. Let me know in the comments below if you want to try these or you're going to try these or you have tried these. I'd love to see how they worked out. Tweet me or Instagram me your final pieces. Have a fantastic week, day, 
hour minute and just enjoy it and I'll see you in the next video. I still don't know how to say bye.